that is the original. Original. Hey, man. Hey, everybody. We hey. missed y'all so much. We're so happy to be back. Hey, if you're back, coming back to see us, and we appreciate you, you're returning to us. We thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. But if you're new to us, well, hi. How are you? Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. Let you know when we drop a vid. We appreciate it so much. It helps our channel grow. And that's what we're needing. And we thank you. Right? That's right. So, anywho, this evening we are joining you. Happy What What Fish Friday! And we cutting right. up. We cutting up. What we doing? We putting in what? That's right. We're doing a catfish fillet. That's really the, the fish part of it. It's catfish yeah, fillet. It's catfish. Yeah. Catfish. But we got catfish, baked macaroni and cheese, Chicken. stuffing, fried chicken wings, Surfing corn, tub. all that kind of stuff. All that good stuff. And a salad. And Amen. Salad. All that good, and good. Man. We're gonna say a prayer. We're gonna get it in. Okay. Say so you lean the prayer. Yes. All right. God's a good. God's great. Let us thank you for our food. Bow our head. Must be fed. Give us the Lord our daily bread. Amen. Amen. But yes, that's what we're having. Um, we're just ready to get in. We're starving. It is what it is. What do you want to do is whatever you want to do. But I do have this bread of fish. We have tartar sauce. Yes. I'll make tartar sauce. I'm going to add a little to my plate. Because we know that's what he'll do. Come on with that tartar sauce. You know how to, you know how we do on the tartar sauce now. The tartar sauce is good. Yeah, her homemade. Look at her. Ah, <laughs> right. And yeah. all my fish. Yeah, I'm sorry. Oh, we gotta have hot sauce on the fish. You know what I'm saying? That's just that's just the cold, okay? That's the cold. Have mm -hmm. hot sauce on the fish. I'm gonna put that right there. Give me it. Oh, do you want that? Yeah, I'll put it in. Matter of fact, I'm. Gonna, why you you put it on your face? I just man, I can't I can't wait. Yeah, I, I put it. You see it? I put it on there. Okay. I put, do I put, you, it, do on, you I put it on on that girlfriend. Do you? Hell do. yeah. Oh my goodness. I am yeah. trying some classic ranch by Marzetti. Classic know. ranch. I don't what's know. The, what's the difference between the old ranch? Well, this one was a little bit more pricey. Well, so I think I'm all that in a bag of chips. Man, I feel important. To get something more pricier. You using Thousand Island? I don't know. But y'all, excuse our absence. We apologize for it. We actually we don't. I mean, we do, but we don't, because <laughs> we have good reason. We've been on a secret little private vacation, some fish without getting grandkids. So they were growing got grand, so you know, the grands come back and be like, Man, I done got that old. That's the root truthness of it. I done got old and got grandkids. Oh my goodness, we're not old, we're not that old, but you know, mm -hmm. I feel old, but we spend time. I don't either. We have very young grandchildren, two, just two boys, a very, 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 very young grandparents that you guys know of and we decided this independence weekend for it to be our vacation with our grandkids including my mom my mom's definitely a you know grandma number one well well i saw my g my grandma she called it gg part two and so we packed everybody up just our son and grandkids, and we went back home, or back where I, we used to live, to see my mom and our beautiful daughter, Shelby, who lays to rest there. Yeah. With our grandkids. <laughs> and let me tell you, it was over the top. Mom and dad stayed home. We were on our own. For the first time, on our complete own. There was no fallback. There was no, we're still in the same town. We're tired. Maybe we should take them home early type of method. No. I wanted us to be 
without that safety net to really know what it felt like to be with them completely alone without their parents, no way out, no way to say, oh, they're, they, they, they probably want to go home. Mm -mm. No. The grandkids had to endure us and we had to endure them. No. Hmm. Wow. Oh, boy. It was... Oh my God! Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, stop! Can I hug? Can, can I talk to you? Can I talk to you for a bit? <laughs> it was like that, but it was beautiful. It was beautiful though. S scary, you know, hard, like, yeah, all that. You know. Well, you know we have uh, um, uh, Kyrie. I'll put him on the screen now. Our beloved, beautiful Kari, who is four years old and full blown autistic. He's nonverbal. So, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They, you know what they want, but they you really do they have no idea. But the basics, it's the basics, and loving them the same, regardless, you know what I mean? Life itself, and regardless. He was so cool. It, no, it went, it went, it went good. He did his thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And yeah. then we have Adonis, a little picture of him. Yeah. Who's only one. Who also did his thing. They, they're each in their own little world, in their own little time zone. And you at the same time. That. You gotta respect them too. You know? Yeah. You gotta separate the two. Which is, which is fine. You know, we're grandparents, you know, we know. So, but we we love them, so we love them, so yeah. My mom was stuck in here and there. Yeah, we had a beautiful Fourth of July vacation with our grandkids, and it just really put things in perspective for me of what their parents go through, of what is expected of us as grandparents. It's like, it's like, what if, if you was put in the same position, would you know, you know, the right answers or what to do? Well, um, the answer is, um, I don't know. What's going on? How you perceive life? So, is that, are you referring to being a grandparent? On both, on both hands. Yeah. I mean, you were as a parent before. A grandparent. Yeah. Being a grandparent is a different feeling. Yes. Because, yeah. You know, even though you didn't give birth to them, right? You, you, you still gotta understand that's that's a child. It's yeah. like you you feel highly responsible for them, but you also have to step back and allow their parents to be parents. And raise their children how they want to raise their children. Exactly. Being a grandparent, you want to put your two cents in. You want to dictate everything, and that makes it harder because they're not being raised how I would raise them. Right. To an extent. So, so or how we would raise them. Different avenues. Yeah. You know. Yeah. So we have to adjust to how their parents are raising them or whatever. And right. Hmm. It's really different. Very. Mm hmm. Very. Always to the point that it's like, man, you know, the one problem, like, man, what, you know. All the way down to the Yeah. And I was like, okay, come back to myself, come back to my senses, like, damn, you know, okay. That's what it's like, so. I had to be a little bit more lenient, you know. Cause and, and know. In the world of an autistic grandson? Yes. That's what he's referred to, you guys. Yeah. Um, yeah. Grandparenting a child with special needs that's autistic. Right. It's very different. Mm. Mm. He's such a sweetheart. Yeah. <sighs> Yeah. 
He knows. Yeah. What are we doing? Yeah. Mm. So if you have autistic children, autistic um, grandchildren, you just gotta be patient with them. You just gotta work with them, you know, as much as you can, because they don't know. So. They test, they test you. Hmm. Oh, he tested his grandpa. Oh yeah, he comes in. <laughs> and his grandma. Yeah. They come back and, and grab me and, you know, just embrace me like, you know, pop out. You, know. you can't help it. Hmm. You know, and I was like, you're right, you know, but I'm here to support you 100% all the way, no matter what. I will stand up and protect the people that I love, and that's important. So. Yes, they're amazing kids. Smart, beautiful, entertaining. It was exciting for me to get to be around them every day for that many amount of days. Day in, day out. You get to know them. Mm -hmm. I mean, I have my grandkids, but it's just one at a time usually. Before Papa came back home, it was too hard for me to take them on both at a time. So, why do you have one or the other? You know, for like a weekend or the day or whatever, the night. You know, that would be about it. But this time was my first time taking them both on for that amount of days without the safety net, aka their parents. Right around the corner, basically, you know. It was like, nah, you finna do this. You finna work the hell to you finna full, You finna feel the whole a full whole flare, flare thing. Okay? What you been on, that's just substantive. That's the thing. Oh. We're dealing with the original. The original. Yeah. Now, um, you're gonna take on, um, what it's all about, you know. Mm. You know, straight, you know, straight raw. I've had them both before, but then I realized, like, without any of them, I can't do them both on my own. All right. Mm -mm. <laughs> I've had them. Don't get me wrong, but once as they got older and more mobile and more different. They got harder. I could take them both on because, you know, Adonis is just a baby baby, so he couldn't go to where or do nothing. Anyway. You know, so he, he was eating, and I could still do with Kai. But now Adonis is walking, eating on his own. Dana trying to talk, you know, he's a whole nother different kid. He's his own little situation. <laughs> I'm going he's, over here. He's not sitting I'm going to touch this right here. I'm going to grab that down right there. I'm going to see what that work right there. You know, I'm just Basically. a baby, so I don't know. I'm one years old, so and then I'm going to go over here and see what see, see what that do is. You know, hey, mm -hmm. it's what we do. This is what I'm doing, okay? You <laughs> have to monitor me, not me monitor you. <laughs> mm -mm. But it was, it was... It was nice vacation. It was nice vacation. So. And basically got home so we could relax. That salad, the crouton. They got us good, y'all. War was out. They did. They won. They won. I had a couple battles that, you know what I'm saying, me and him went a you know, went upon, but you know, I, I won. But you know, the rest of it, I just couldn't. I, uh, it was, it was getting, getting overwhelmed. I was like, he win, he win. Carter? Yes. 
And mama laughing. Mama was like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You mama, mama, right now. You talking about my mom? Yeah, you're talking about her mom. You ain't gonna win too many more. You mo, you won the moment right now. But I already know. I was like, how does she know all this? Cause she, we been having. How does she know all this? It's cause I'm your mama, stupid. She's like, oh, you right. I been on you. <laughs> mm -hmm. So you know. It was, it was it was hard, man. It was, it was hard, but you know I still had to go back to myself and be like, okay, they're still young. You think Kai was harder than Adonis? Um, Adonis had this moment, but I can always Adonis was different. Adonis was like, you know. Donald's has to stay up. That's where we. You, I stay up. He like he like to stay up. He was wearing you out. You but, he so wore me, tired. but he wore me out. Cause we were tired. I used to stay up. You know. Anyway, but yeah, but not dealing with the baby. That's a whole other story. To about twelve thirty one o'clock, I was like, oh. And not getting to watch what you want to watch, and not entertain yourself. You up watching cartoons. I'm, 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 like, I'm watching cartoons, entertaining him. It's his world. So it's gonna make you sleepy because you're bored or right. something. Entertaining. Drive me crazy. Banana balls. And you're watching That's the same darn movie that he yeah. even watched like 10 and, and times. He, he likes it. So, but he likes it and you want to keep him calm and cool and collected. Exactly. So you're going to play it. And he over, be, and and over, and and over and over and over again. again. <sighs> I said, boy. If I have to but hear Wreck-It Ralph on my tongue. But he's be right, like you said, he'd be right there with the characters and he just, he, he's a part of it. He's like, yeah, you know, Dora, you know, let's go find her. Mm -hmm. That way. I'm with y'all. And he's laughing and clapping. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Yeah, Donna watches a movie. Mm-hmm. His little stuff stays in the TV. Talking, oh jibber jabbing, and cool. laughing, cool. and just be completely all up in the movie. He loves the parts, you know, when he's really into it, and he's just like, you can tell he just seems like he's just in the movie. He's emerged in it. Seriously, Adonis watches TV almost like, like his grandma does, you know, just emerges himself into the program. Mm -hmm. One thousand percent. Mm -hmm. And you can tell by his little demeanor that he's just there. He doesn't even watch where he's walking. When he <laughs> he'll be walking backwards, tripping over stuff, because he just he just all he's doing is looking at the TV. And I don't want to be in that generation where the TV he's raised by the TV, but I'm not in his household 24 seven. Um, he's used to being around in the TV, and you can tell because that he goes into his world and he just zones out. Yeah. He, nothing else is around him. He's just into the TV. And when he doesn't have that, I right, Jordan, find something to get into. I'm gonna pull the curtain down. I'm gonna get on top of this chair. I'm gonna get behind the chair. Um, uh, what they tell me not to do, I'm gonna go right back to it. Anything you, yeah, anything you can yell at right him about. Right back to it, right back to it, because well, I, I'm bored, him, I'm just. Redirect him. Right. We, we, you know what I'm saying, we give them something to, you know, um, pay attention to, you know, mm -hmm. get his mind turned, you know, but they're just kids, though, they're, mm -hmm. they're kids, so you gotta be mindful of that, so. They're a little hard. But man, I firmly believe we got our butts handed to us. No doubt. They won. What's good in your life that's so important than life itself? If I don't know, I don't know. Why not guide me? You know, kids are kids. You, you have to teach them. Not them teaching you. Does that make any sense? 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. No. Mm-hmm. It's smoked chicken. It's smoked chicken, by the way. When you come to that. About chicken, dry. Um, I've been loving chicken ever since I was. You're always hungry. <laughs> For some chicken. Oh, chicken? Wait. You always hungry. I was craving more of this fish. But y'all, yeah, my belly's getting full. But no, I think Independence Weekend was a nice one. It was a good one. Very tiresome one, but I'm glad we did it. It's kind of like your typical staycation. We didn't go far, but we were far enough. Yeah. See, Independence, you know, it's just, you know, what you work all your life for, you know. Hey. You don't want all your life for no staycation. I was talking about the independence part, man. I'm kidding. I'm gonna throw you in your head. Anyway, you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about, world. Yeah. We're gonna elaborate. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We, we down. We, we down. We down. That's right. Yeah. But she threw down, though. Threw down on the food and stuff. You like it? I, I'm gonna I'm hire her at my, at my new restaurant. I'm gonna get it. She's gonna. You understand what I'm saying? I don't know what you're Woo. I'm getting full. Yeah, sorry. Fish Friday for real. That catfish fillet was huge for me. Really big. But I was really, really enjoying it. I'm getting full. How are you? Are you still able to eat? Dang, yo. Okay. I'm still going. You still going? I like an energy bunny. Mm -hmm. But, but, uh, yeah, burp. So, yeah. Oh, no, you didn't. Mm -hmm. Oh, I thought I was going to be more, uh, more meaningful. And what I was gonna say, y'all. Um, <laughs> I thought I was gonna have some kind of a meaningful point. <laughs> we got nothing to say. About grandparenting. At the end of the day, I really don't. Yeah, I'm happy to be a grandparent now because I can take the behinds home, <laughs> drop that behind off, she, love them dearly, get to love wore, them far. She got a out. But. What the hell? What the hell? I, I'm tired. <laughs> That's the point of me being grand. Because I've already been there, done that. Grandparents, you know, we're grand, like, like a thousand. I'm not ashamed of it. I'm not embarrassed by it. All right. I mean, okay. Mm -hmm. But. But. I'm doing Don't better. you start repeating everything I said. Don't you, don't you start it. This is not Pete and repeat. You know what I'm saying? I got an echo. Everything he's saying it right back. He's doing it in it, y'all. Y'all be seeing the video. He'll do that. He's my echo, apparently. I'll start hearing him. <laughs> Pete, you repeat. What? This is not Pinky in the Brain. I didn't say Pete and the Brain. So Pete and the Brain show. are two different people. I said Pete and repeat. Same thing. No, it's not. Pinky and the Brain did not repeat brain. each other. The Brain was the brain he wanted to take over the world. Right. Pinky. Pinky was behind him. Was the, just one. Exactly. He's assistant. But he didn't repeat it. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Okay, yes, I'm he the Brain did. and you're Pinky. Aww. I ain't say that either. For Pinky and the Brain. Don't For believe Pinky that. and the Brain. <laughs> Don't believe that. Don't believe that shit. Mm -hmm. Call it what you want to call it. I ain't going eat. there with you. Eat, Bubba's eat. Oh. Did you see that problem? You got me? I'm messing with him because my belly can, is, is. Yeah. What is, what is, what is it? He about to pop! <laughs> <laughs> That's all it is. My love, you about to pop, nigga. You about to slow down. Go oh, pop. I am mine. 
I mean, I didn't realize how much I was taking in. I, I didn't even pay attention. Y'all think I didn't put a date in it, but I did. I had a huge plate to start off with. I know there's a lot left. It seems like there's a lot left, but you guys know, I tell you that every time. I've made a humongous plate for the camera. And, ooh. Plus, I got a side of the want to eat with us. Mm. Mm. He's got more more room to grub than me. Mm -hmm. Grub a boat. Grub. Do your thug fizzle. Smoke. Chicken wings? Come on, man. It's awesome right there. Mm. I wish you could taste it. I, I did taste it. <laughs> oh, you talking about them? Talking to you. <laughs> Can't talk about the people out there that you wish could taste right. it. Not someone who's sitting right here who could taste yeah, it. Yeah, you just taste it. Yeah. All right. Got it. Get it, got it good. No, but that's where we've been. No, we uh, we really did need to take that time out, especially since he's been here, and really, truly, truly dive into that world and be with them. And we appreciate you guys allowing us to take that time to do that. I hope you guys understand that we weren't abandoning the channel or abandoning you. We just needed some personal time. And the record during that time frame was really not as easy as it may have seemed. Because <laughs> everybody was on different schedules, especially with the kids and their schedule and how they were going to do it anyway. No. It was a handful. It was a lot. Yeah, I was cooking running. and cleaning yeah. and cooking and cleaning yeah. and cleaning and cooking. He was running and chasing and doing. Where are you going? What you doing? Stop that. Don't do that. Stop, please. Sit down and uh, film was like, <laughs> I will throw myself in the trash can for a do it. Like, I just couldn't do it. I, by the time we got a meal in this, or we were able to eat, we just wanted to eat. Mm -mm. And go straight to sleep. And go to sleep. I, Quickly. We, we, we didn't, I, I couldn't think about filming. I couldn't think about, I was like, we, most of the time we ate, what, Taco Bell? Yeah. Like late night Taco Bell, I sneak off while the, after we got the kids to sleep. The only restaurant open is McDonald's or Taco Bell. Creepy. We sneak to Taco Bell at McDonald's to get us a little bit of something. Or, you know, we cooked or whatever. Whatever the case may be, we just, it was just off setting, off times. And it was just really, really, or he'd eat with the kids. I'd feed him when they were eating. And then, of course, I wouldn't be hungry. Already, eat. there was just no way because we each had a tag team. Because my mom was also working during it, she didn't have a big hey, it was me, and so we'd have to basically tag team, you know, watching the kids. We could have a meal, so lots of the times he ate, we had to do a when the kids w, yeah. ate, I'd feed him with them, yeah, because that was plausible and that I could be free to do stuff I need to do. He'd eat. And then he'd get his belly full so he can help deal with them after their belly was full. And then me, I'm cleaning up the kitchen, you know. It was just, we just, our schedules this with the babies just wasn't, Tight. couldn't. And then throwing filming on top of that. Y'all, 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 y'all know. We were tired. Couldn't do all that. But we're back. We're here. Life is getting back to normal. So we can enjoy you guys and enjoy some good food. I'm so happy you guys tuned in. Hey, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Notification bell lets you know when we drop a vid. Please like the video. Please. <laughs> comment. Hit, 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 the button, hit the button. Hit the button. Comment. So we know you did all that so we can say something to you and share the vid if you want to. We are done. We're wrapping this up. We love you. We're here, we're always here, we're not going nowhere. You take care. And what it? Goodbye. Bye bye. Bye bye.